the Golden State Warriors have signed two former Gonzaga basketball players. First one we're going to talk about is Jeremy Pargo. Now, Jeremy Pargo got drafted in 2000, uh, well, entered the 2009 draft class and ended up going undrafted. Um, he was total superstar at Gonzaga, uh, like you can see, sports, made the Sports Illustrated page. Um, he was like one of the first players to get Gonzaga on track. Um, but he played for multiple teams. First team, actually, I don't know. I think he was drafted by the 76ers, but he played for 76ers, Cavaliers, and Grizzlies. And he's been out of the league since 2012, March. I believe it's March 3rd, 2012 was the uh, last time he played in the NBA. Um, but he has been on the G League team for the Golden State Warriors for I don't know how long, probably eight-ish years. He's also been in the Big Three. He's been all around. Uh, he's played internationally in Europe, France. He's played just about everywhere. Like played against uh, LeBron James when he was in France for like one of those international games. Uh, that could have been France or Europe. I'm not sure. Um, but he played just about everywhere. And then they find the Warriors finally gave him a 10-day contract um, today, and he showed up to the game, played today, ended up scoring six points. Grabbed two rebounds and dished out four assists. Um, so, you know, decent game. But yeah, glad he got his time to shine. The next player we're going to be talking about is Zach Norvell Jr. Now, Zach Norvell Jr. Uh, entered the 2019 draft and also went undrafted uh, from Gonzaga. Another superstar from Gonzaga. Crazy good player. Uh, he was a sophomore last year. He played two years for Gonzaga and then ended up entering the draft where he ended up going undrafted. But he was signed to the Warriors on a two-day contract where he was waived and then re-signed. But he ended up getting waived around December 20-something or just mid to end of December. He he ended up getting waived, um, and then they ended up deciding, signing Devonte Kaycock as you can. He's number twelve on the left there, um, but he's been on the South Bay Lakers, which is the Lakers G League team, for um, a while now. He was his probably best play plays on the Lakers was when he bl broke Jordan Poole's ankles in two different games um, and got an and one on one of them and the other one he just scored and that was crazy he just broke his ankles really good but Zach Norvell uh, has been out of the league since December of 2019 so it's been it's been like two months pretty much um, and I'm finally I'm happy that he finally got his time to shine as well he also got a 10-day contract uh, with the Golden State Warriors. Now this worked out perfectly because both Norvell and Pargo, uh, Norvell was playing for the Lakers G League team, so he probably just traveled with the Lakers to that game and then ended up because uh, it was in it was in Golden State. So then he just played at the Warriors, and uh, Pargo has been on the Warriors G League team, playing really well, averaging around. 20, 15-ish to 20 points. Um, same with Norvell for the South Bay Lakers. So it worked out perfectly for them. Norvell ended up scoring 7 points, getting 4 rebounds and 2 assists. I might have already said that, but <laughs> just saying it again. He in, he had a pretty good game. He made 2 threes like back-to-back, -back, and then he ended up making a technical foul free throw. But yeah, guys, thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys next time. Thanks for watching. Subscribe.